Holy crap! Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. This- How- how is this- how can this be possible? Maybe the tuning's like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy, then, cause I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. This is so cool. I know! Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they, they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. <sighs> she should just seriously get over it already. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... Huh. Brownies are kicking in. Did that make sense? Kind of. I got it. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. God, it sounds so... Yeah, it sounds... Uh... It's freaking me out a little. Yeah. Wait, what was that? There's like... This is gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous last words. Uh, yeah, what is that? I'm sure there is something in there. Like a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something. Like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> oh boy. If it's a pool, that'd be cool. I, um, didn't mean that to rhyme. <laughs> cool pool. Fortune favors the bold. <laughs> Bye. That was an Wait a minute! Jonas! Well, I am going to just rest against here, because I think... I think I mismeasured the magic. Jonas! Jonas! Seriously, where are you? I bring an ashtray down here, or a pen. See a man about a dog. Sure, will do. 
Didn't you hear yeah. me calling for you? Jesus, you scared me. Oh, I scared you? You scared me. I had no idea where you were. I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know, obviously there isn't. But isn't this place incredible? I mean, I don't even know how this how this happens. It's honestly creeping me out. I feel like we're in Satan's underground lair. <laughs> it's a little creepy, but I mean, it's all just a cave. Just a natural cave. See? That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Kinda? I don't know where it's coming from. What could that be? Echoes? Sounds of the ocean bouncing off the walls? Beats me, I failed geology. <sighs> there was a light in here somewhere. I still want to see what made it. It must just be further in. Let's try and find it before we go back. Well, seeing as how I crawled in here to get you, might as well make the most of it. Yeah, and I mean, look, if it's cool, we can get the others, and if it's not, we'll just leave. Like, what is this made out of? What? Is it ice? Wow, how is that? Did, did you see the floating, um, triangle light thing? Um, yes. It, it must be like a, like a rainbow, or like a reflection of light? Those, um, exist, right? Um, cave, triangle rainbows? Sure, why not? Let's go with that, for the time being. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there in the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I... Apart from the, um, triangle, this is honestly the craziest thing in here. Like, how did it even get in? And I mean, aside from some, like, water damage, it's not really even that junky. I know. Try your radio. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like if it'll have an effect. Yeah, good idea. Maybe it'll dance or twitch or something. Let's do it. Come on. Radio time. Oh my god. Is this... Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Yeah. I can't even... Like, what is... What? Is it... It... What? What the... Is insane. Uh, who are are you? Who are you on the? Listen, Bob two. Shame two. Sleeping time. Time now. Is possible. I, I, I don't know what you mean. So I can't. Bob two. Leave, children. Bye. See you soon. Alex. Alex? Are you okay? You alright? I... think so? I don't know. God... Do I... look alright? You look... alive, I guess. Look, I'm just gonna cut to the whatever, like, I don't know exactly what happened back there. But the sign says that's an old communications tower, and I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the party just kind of pooped. I don't know. This is kind of exciting, right? Excite- Uh, don't touch that, please. I'd really prefer not telling your mom that you're dead. She might not take too well to the news. How do you know it even works? It works. I know you think this stuff is fun or whatever, 
But I'm sorry, we don't really know what's going on. Yeah, we don't know what's going on, but it's like weird and crazy and magic. So, I mean, don't you want to... No, I don't. Whatever you're going to say, unless it's leave, I don't want to at all. Oh, and not for nothing. I'm fine with a little deep pantsing or whatever if the weather's right for it. But if this is some sort of prank or trick, I'm really, really not in the mood. So, if it is, the time... Jonas, believe me, I wouldn't do that to you. Harden Tower. Oh, it's called that, I think, because the radio man who watched it, he was Major Richard Harden. I don't know why I remember that. <laughs> Wait, the guy's name was Major Dick Harden? <laughs> oh, grow up. Oh, come on! You know that's amazing! Dick Harden? And they named a tower after him? It's all right. It's a soaker. You'll get it later. What do you think happened to them? Probably the same thing as us. Transmogrified or whatever to some other part of the island. Great. <sighs> it's locked. Let me try. And what exactly can you do except jiggle it more? Oh, you'll see. What's the expression? Skills of a misspent youth? That's not an expression. <clears throat> well, if you want to do things the easy way, sure. Get anyone? I don't think so. Warning, do not use aboard ship. Unsafe radiation limits. You know, I'd normally find this stuff kinda interesting, really. You know, normally. <sighs> you don't have to make me feel better about getting you trapped on Horror Island. Horror Island? It sounds a little different than what we're on right now. Why would you think I said Horror Island? Um... I don't know. There's a dial tone, but there's a note here. Does not call out. Please dial station code for service. There wouldn't happen to be a code there, would there? Nada. Ah! Jesus! Hello? Alex? Alex? Is that when? you? Oh, Jesus, Hoppin' Christ! Thank Vishnu! I... You guys went into that hole and a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what happened. I just woke up like 15 minutes ago. I, I saw the light on in the, uh, the tower thing. Hey, did you know that it's named after some guy named Dick Harden? <laughs> Ren, how are you calling us? Phones don't work here. It's, it's a code written on this list here. But it's not a normal phone. I can't call out. I'm at, uh, the way station or whatever in the woods. It's been like, like, just the worst thing ever. Just DEFCON Fuchsia level terrible ever since- Ren, are you alright? Like, physically alright? Because I know mentally you're no, probably- No, I'm not alright! I mean, do I sound alright or do I sound not alright? I probably sound not alright, right? Wait, I, I, I think that's the other line. Maybe it's like a night watchman or something, or they do like, check-ins maybe? Wait, Ren, someone's calling on the other line. Just hold on a minute. I'm gonna see who it is. 
Okay, but make it quick, seriously. Hello? Oh, Jesus Christ, Alex? Why are you answering it? This, it says it's an emergency line. Where are you right now? Clarissa? And Jonas is with you. Of course he is. I'm in the comm tower, Clarissa. Where are you? I, I don't know. I'm somewhere in Fort Milner. I don't know why. I, I don't remember, like, the last hour. I'm trying to call somebody, but I'm in a room with radio stuff that can, it says it can contact Kamina, but I don't, I have no idea how to make it work. Can you just come over here and figure this out with me? I don't care if you guys want to stay. I just Yeah, wanna... sure. We'll be over there in a minute. Okay, just hurry, okay? There's like... I don't know. I'm hearing stuff outside. Fort Milner looked huge on the map. Do you know where the... And it dies, ladies and... Ren, are you still there? Yeah, I guess that'd be too easy. You told Clarissa we're coming, so want to truck over to Milner first? See about that radio? I mean, Clarissa can be a handful, Fence but... Fence should be off now. Great, but, um, don't take offense if I want to throw a stick at it first. Come on, don't you trust me? The light turned off. I trust you to, like, not hurt me on purpose or anything, but, you know, if the fence kills me on accident, it's not really about trust at that point. <sighs> so, anyways, it sounds like Clarissa has a way to talk to the mainland, so we should maybe go there first? Maybe that's more important right now. Before stuff gets, uh... I'm sure she can handle flipping the switch to talk all by herself. Look, I'm gonna leave it up to you. We can swing through the forest in Nabren, or we can go to the fort and see what Clarissa's up to. They're your people. You can decide. Ren needs us more. And he'd kill me if he knew we went to see Clarissa first. Sound logic. Seventeen shots, no thirty-eight. Yeah, I got the duck in my robbery. Seventeen shots, no thirty-eight. Yeah, she 